Welcome to Castrol Active Champions, a journey around the lives of some of the finest cricketers. Now, Castrol Active, through its Activons, continuously protecting your bike engine, whether it's running or it's off. And protection is a theme that is at the core of the life of the champion we are featuring today. Gautam Gambhir has two passions in life. The more known passion is cricket, but he is absolutely taken in by the protection that the army affords. I remember this time we were at the Eden Gardens, just before play is about to start, and one of our technicians casually walked across and I said to Gautam, you know what, he's actually served in Siachen. And that was it, I was out of the conversation after that, because everything was about the life of the army and how is it at those altitudes and how do you protect yourself. And as that conversation went, I almost thought I must tell Gautam, I said, remember there's a, there's a game starting very soon, but he was so caught up in that. And so it came as no surprise to me to learn a little later that he had decided to fund the education of children of 25 martyred soldiers. That's very much Gautam Gambhir for you. Had I not been the cricketer, I would have definitely been the army. That is one regret I still have and that will always stay for the rest of my life. So I thought that uh, obviously I couldn't join the army, but uh, definitely if uh, I can make any contribution to the army or to the defense forces, uh, what better than uh, trying to help uh, children uh, in their education and uh, make them achieve whatever they've dreamt of. So obviously that is my way of contributing uh, uh, to the defense forces and to the country as well. Gambhir was at the core of two of the biggest events in Indian cricket history. The final of the World T20 in 2007. Now, Irfan Pathan was man of the match that day. It was, it was Gambhir's battling 70 that ensured that India got to 150 and had a total to play with. And then that final in 2011. You remember it for uh, Mahendra Singh Dhoni's finish. You remember it for Yuvraj Singh's heroics and yet after Tendulkar and Sehwag had fallen early, it was Gautam Gambhir who held that innings together with that 90. I so wish that day that he went on and made it a century. It wasn't to be, but it doesn't take away from the fact that at a crucial phase in that run chase in the 2011 World Cup final, it was Gautam Gambhir who was protecting India's interests and holding that innings together. And I think you must always remember him for that. And yet, there's one other innings that I remember and it came in Napier in 2009. India fighting back to try and defend the game, to try and save the game. And he batted 11 hours for 137. And I remember saying at the time that that was a genuine coming of age innings. Whenever you start doing well in test cricket in your career, people start questioning you whether you're going to be able to be successful overseas. And, and we had to bat two and a half days. I remember that uh, we were given the follow on. So it was my time. I thought that uh, it's, it's the idle time for me to try and show the world that what I'm capable of and uh, obviously the stage was set and the most important thing was to be patient because that is something which I never had. I never experienced something like that, that I had so much of patience inside me. After that inning I realised that what actually does a human mind has if he decides to do something and that's where I realised that uh, maybe I, was, I had loads uh, full of patience. I've always admired the ability in Gambhir to be able to give credit where it is due to, to take his teammates along with him. And you saw that in 2009, India playing against Sri Lanka, there's 315 to chase. Gambhir anchored that chase, 150 not out, he was man of the match. But you also remember that game because it was the first of so many one day centuries for Virat Kohli, still a very, very young man. We're talking 2009, Gautam Gambhir is man of the match and he's, he announces that he wants to share it with a young man who played as big a part in winning that game. You don't see that too often. I remember we were chasing 330 odd and we were 10 or 12 for two. We lost Sachin and Viru early. And then uh, it was a game uh, It was a game to be won. It was a game to be won and, and the series to be won as well. I remember we won that game and we won the series as well. So I thought that Virat batted really well and uh, scored his first international 100. So I thought that uh, uh, let's make it a little special for him as well because I remember that whenever he would wash, uh, whenever he would see that trophy, it would uh, remind him of his first uh, international hundred. So obviously that was the thought process, nothing else. Gautam Gambhir was a serious cricketer. There's no question about that. 4,000 Test runs, 5,000 one-day international runs. But I just wonder if in the years to come, people will remember him as much as captain of the Kolkata Knight Riders. 2011 was a wonderful year for him. 
the winning of the World Cup, but also that path-breaking auction at the IPL when they picked the Kolkata Knight Riders, picked Gautam Gambhir as captain and they needed this strong character, almost a protector character in the rebuilding of the Kolkata Knight Riders and Gautam Gambhir did that and he delivered them two wins in 2012 and 2014. And I think in the story of Gautam Gambhir, Kolkata Knight Riders will always hold center stage. To me, the image of Gautam Gambhir is of a player who always delivered 100%. A bit like Castrol Active's active bonds that are continuously protecting your bike engine whether it's running or whether it's off. He was that kind of player, Gautam Gandhi. Central to big performances, this warrior person with him who's in love with the army, but more than anything else, someone who always gave 100% whether it was India or the Kolkata Knight Riders. There you are, that's what we've got for you today on Castrol Active Champions. Remember, there's one coming your way every week.